It's our story. Patrick Connolly, Berkeley, California. Well, I think that, that shows political action. You know, I mean, those people kept voting for Republicans. Those disabled people did not enforce the ADA. They did not demand that their elected officials and judges and, and stuff reflect community standards that included inclusion of people with disabilities. Instead, those people set them up to be sitting ducks, and a lot of them literally were, were killed and executed because there was nowhere to go. They couldn't get out. They were either going to float to the top of the ceiling and drown, or you can give them a shot because there was uh, nothing there. Um, no paratran... Alice, no. Um, there was no paratransit. Access into court, you know, shelters and things was denied because pe there was no accessibility. You know, the infrastructure wasn't there to go forward. Um, and people died. I mean, because we're in a society now, we're not, you know, um, we're three, four hundred million people. I mean, we, we live interconnectedly. We can't all just go out and grow our food, and we can't all just be responsible for ourselves anymore. Um, because we are that, there's that many of us, and we're that on top of each other. The It's Our Story Project is a national effort to make disability history public and accessible. Visit us at www.itsourstory.org or on the It's Our Story Project YouTube channel.